The Earth System Governance Project is a long-term, interdisciplinary social science research program originally developed under the auspices of the International Human Dimensions Program on Global Environmental Change. It started in January 2009. The Earth System Governance Project currently consists of a network of CA. 300 active and about 2,300 indirectly involved scholars from all continents. The project has evolved into the largest social science research network in the area of governance and global environmental change. The Earth System Governance Project office is hosted at Lund University, Sweden. Topic. Aims. The Earth System Governance Project aims to contribute to science on the large, complex challenges of governance in an era of rapid and large-scale environmental change. The project seeks to create a better understanding of the role of institutions, organizations and governance mechanisms by which humans regulate their relationship with the natural environment. The Earth System Governance Project aims to integrate governance research at all levels. The project aims to examine problems of the global commons, but also local problems from air pollution to the preservation of waters, waste treatment or desertification and soil degradation. However, due to natural interdependencies local environmental pollution can be transformed into changes of the global system that affect other localities. Therefore, the Earth System Governance Project looks at institutions and governance processes both local and globally. The Earth System Governance Project is a scientific effort, but also aims to assist policy responses to the pressing problems of Earth system transformation. Topic. Conceptual framework The Earth System Governance Project organizes its research according to a conceptual framework guided by five analytical problems. These are the problems of the overall architecture of Earth System governance, of agency beyond the state and of the state, of the adaptiveness of governance mechanisms and processes, of their accountability and legitimacy and of modes of allocation and access in Earth System governance. The concept of Earth System governance is defined as the interrelated and increasingly integrated system of formal and informal rules, rule-making systems, and actor networks at all levels of human society from local to global that are set up to steer societies towards preventing, mitigating, and adapting to global and local environmental change and, in particular, earth system transformation, within the normative context of sustainable development. Topic. Origin and history In 2001, the four then active Global Change Research Programs -E International Geosphere Biosphere Program, World Climate Research Program, and International Human Dimensions Program on Global Environmental Change agreed to intensify cooperation through setting up an overarching Earth System Science Partnership. The research communities represented in this partnership contend in the 2001 Amsterdam Declaration on Global Change that the Earth system now operates well outside the normal state exhibited over the past 500,000 years and that human activity is generating change that extends well beyond natural variability in some cases, alarmingly so and at rates that continue to accelerate. To cope with this challenge, the four global change research programs have called urgently for strategies for Earth system management. In March 2007, in response to the 2001 Amsterdam Declaration, the Scientific Committee of the International Human Dimensions Program on Global Environmental Change, IHDP, the overarching social science program in the field, mandated the drafting of the science plan of the Earth System Governance Project by a newly appointed Scientific Planning Committee. 
The Earth System Governance Project builds on the results of an earlier long-term research program, the IHDP Core Project Institutional Dimensions of Global Environmental Change In 2008, the Earth System Governance Project was officially launched. In 2009, the Science and Implementation Plan of the Earth System Governance Project was published. In the Science and Implementation Plan, the conceptual problems, cross-cutting themes, flagship projects, and its policy relevance are outlined in detail. The Science Plan was written by an international, interdisciplinary scientific planning committee chaired by Professor Frank Bierman, which drew on a consultative process that started in 2004. Several working drafts of this science plan have been presented and discussed at a series of international events and conferences, and numerous scholars in the field, as well as practitioners, have offered suggestions, advice, and critique. Since then, the project has evolved into a broader research alliance that builds on an international network of research centers, lead faculty, and research fellows. After the termination of the IHDP in 2014, the activities of the Earth System Governance Research Alliance are supported by an international steering group of representatives of the main Earth System Governance Research Centers and the global group of lead faculty and research fellows. Topic: <laughs> Global Research Network For its activities and implementation, the Earth System Governance Project relies on a global network of experts from different academic and cultural backgrounds. The research network consists of different groups of scientific experts. The Earth System Governance Project operates under the direction of a scientific steering group chaired by Frank Bierman. The role of the Scientific Steering Committee is to guide the implementation of the Earth System Governance Science Plan. The lead faculty of the Earth System Governance Project is a group of individual scientists who take over shared responsibility for the development of research on particular analytical problems. Earth System Governance Fellows are scientists who link their own research projects with the broader themes and questions raised by the Earth System Governance Science and Implementation Plan. An important element in the project organization is the Global Alliance of Research Centres that brings together the VU University Amsterdam, the Australian National University, Chiang Mai University, Colorado State University, Lund University, University of East Anglia, University of Oldenburg, the Stockholm Resilience Centre, the University of Toronto, the Tokyo Institute of Technology and Yale University. In addition, strong networks on Earth System Governance research exist in China, Latin America, Central and Eastern Europe, and Russia. Topic. Conferences Since 2007, the project has organized major scientific conferences addressing the topics of governance and global environmental change, including 2007 Amsterdam Conference on the Human Dimensions of Global Environmental Change Earth System Governance – Theories and Strategies for Sustainability 2008 Berlin Conference on the Human Dimension of Global Environmental Change Long-Term Policies, Governing Social Ecological Change 2009 7th International Science Conference on the Human Dimensions of Global Environmental Change Social Challenges of Global Change 2009 Amsterdam Conference on the Human Dimensions of Global Environmental Change Earth System Governance, People, Places, and the Planet 2010 Berlin Conference on the Human Dimensions of Global Environmental Change Social Dimensions of Environmental Change and Governance 2011 Colorado Conference on Earth System Governance. Crossing Boundaries and Building Bridges 
2012 Lund Conference on Earth System Governance. Towards Just and Legitimate Earth System Governance 2013 Tokyo Conference on Earth System Governance. Complex Architectures, Multiple Agents 2014 Norwich Conference on Earth System Governance. Allocation and Access in the Anthropocene 2015 Canberra Conference on Earth System Governance. Democracy and Resilience in the Anthropocene Topic research output The network of researchers affiliated with the Earth System Governance Project has brought out many reports and books, and has published in journals such as International Environmental Agreements, Politics, Law and Economics, Ecological Economics, Global Environmental Change, Environmental Science and Policy Global Environmental Politics and Current Opinion in Environmental Sustainability Recurring research topics of the Earth System governance project are water governance, climate governance and fragmentation of global environmental governance. A related MIT Press book series is designed to address the research challenge of earth system governance. Additionally, the project publishes regular working papers, which are peer-reviewed online publications that broadly address questions raised by the project's science and implementation plan. Several special issues of topics related to Earth system governance have been published in scientific journals over the last years. August 2010, special issue on, Transparency in Global Environmental Governance, Global Environmental Politics November 2011, special issue on Earth System Governance, International Environmental Agreements, Politics, Law and Economics February 2011, special issue, Agency in Earth System Governance, International Environmental Agreements, Politics, Law and Economics September 2011, special issue on Accountability in Earth System Governance, Ecological Economics February 2012, Transforming Governance and Institutions of Global Sustainability, Key Insights from the Earth System Governance Project, Current Opinion in Environmental Sustainability March 2012, Navigating the Anthropocene, Improving Earth System Governance, Science March 2013, Sustainable Development Goals for People and Planet, Nature March 2014, 14, special issue, Sustainable Development in a Globalized World, The Journal of Environment and Development May 2014, Earth System Challenges and a Multi-Layered Approach for the Sustainable Development Goals Post-2015, UNUIAS Policy Brief NR, 1 May 2014, Linking Education and Water in the Sustainable Development Goals Post-2015, UNUIAS Policy Brief. NR.2 May 2014, Integrating Governance into the Sustainable Development Goals Post-2015, UNUIAS Policy Brief. NR. 3. Topic. Education programs Earth system governance as a research object is quickly emerging, and as a consequence, the number of education programs on bachelor, master and doctoral level related to earth system governance steadily increases. A number of institutes and universities currently collaborate in a global alliance of Earth System Governance Research Centers, including Ecosystems, Resilience and Governance, University of Stockholm and Stockholm Resilience Center, Sweden Environmental Studies and Sustainability Science, LOOMS, International Master's Program, Lund University, Sweden Environment and Resource Management, VU University Amsterdam, the Netherlands Global Environmental Governance, Specialization Track in MSc Political Science, VU University Amsterdam, the Netherlands Lund University Center of Excellence for Integration of Social and Natural Dimensions of Sustainability, LUCID, Research School, Lund University, Sweden Sustainability Economics and Management, MSc Programme, University of Oldenburg, Germany 
Environmental Governance Related Programs, MA, MSc, and PhD Programs, Colorado State University, United States of America Environment and Development Programs, MSc, MREs, and MBA Programs, University of East Anglia, United Kingdom A substantial number of the workshops and other events of the project are capacity building activities. The project also organizes, endorses and provides teaching to summer schools and capacity building events and programs. In addition, members of the Scientific Steering Group and staff of the International Project Office give guest lectures around the world. Topic. Task forces The Earth System Governance Project organizes task forces, international networks of senior and early career scholars with a series of working groups focused on particular ideas or idea clusters. There are currently two active task forces. Task Force on Conceptual Foundations of Earth System Governance This task force aims to explore key concepts with regard to Earth system governance, such as planetary boundaries, green economy, resilience and the Anthropocene. It aims to critically examine and further refine these novel governance ideas. Task Force on Methodology for Earth System Governance Research This task force seeks aims to advance quantitative Earth System Governance research by promoting new international research collaborations, fostering interaction and dialogue among existing research projects, and developing architectures to promote the building and sharing of datasets. Topic. Policy influence In 2011, the Earth System Governance Project launched an initiative on international environmental governance. This initiative aims to provide a forum for discussion of current and ongoing research on international environmental governance and the institutional framework for sustainable development. In the period leading up to the 2012 United Nations Conference on Sustainable Development in Rio de Janeiro, also known as Rio Plus 20. In addition, the initiative aims to target decision makers and to contribute not just to a better understanding but also to actual improvements in international environmental governance towards an institutional framework that enables sustainable development. Topic. Context There is widespread support for the Earth System Governance Project in the scientific community, which is reflected in the size of the research network and in various publications by experts. However, criticisms of the Earth System Governance Project have also been made. In an internal report of the International Human Dimensions Program it is stated that the steering group of the Earth System Governance Project is too much dominated by experts from OECD countries. Since then, the Earth System Governance Project has actively sought ways to involve experts from different regions of the world. The idea of Earth system governance has also been criticized for being too top-down, for placing too much emphasis on global governance structures. According to Mike Holm, Earth system governance represents an attempt to geopolitically engineer our way out of the climate crisis. He questions whether the climate is governable and argues that it is way too optimistic and even hubristic to attempt to control the global climate by universal governance regimes. This interpretation of the novel concept, however, has been rejected by other scholars as being too narrow and misleading. Topic. Related projects. Earth System Science Partnership International Geosphere Biosphere Program International Human Dimensions Program World Climate Research Program 
DIVERSITAS, an international program for biodiversity research Global Carbon Project Land-ocean interactions in the coastal zone Global Land Project Urbanization and Global Environmental Change Project Global Water System Project Topic. See also The Anthropocene Climate governance Earth system governance Earth system analysis, Earth system science Ecological economics Ecological modernization Environmental governance Environmental policy Environmental science Global Carbon Project Global Change Global Governance Global Environmental Governance Global Land Project Multi-level Governance Social Science Sustainable Development Sustainability Governance Sustainability Science Planetary boundaries asterisk transition management Urbanization and Global Environmental Change Project UGEC